Okay guys, uh, so this morning I want to show you a video of parts of Manhattan. Um, it's for like people who don't live here. So this is currently 28th Street and 10th Avenue. And recently, I think last year, they built the Hudson Yard. So I'm just going to show you a little bit of it. Okay, so right there, there's the High Line. And there's an entrance where you could just walk up the steps. And that building on the left is uh, Zaha Hadid. Uh, that was an architecture who designed the building, I guess. And it's in the million dollar zone to like get an apartment there or a condo. And right across the street here on 10th Avenue, there's a field where children could go play. And now we're on 29th Street and 10th Ave. And then there's the continuation of the High Line. There's no entrance here for you to go up to the High Line. So you have to either go in from 28th Street or like 31st Street, I think. Yeah, so if you look here, here's another view of Hudson Yards. These things are just monstrous looking. And below here where you see the sign for the street, that's another part of the High Line. And you could actually go there and sit and I think sometimes people like dance and sing and have like music and stuff. You could just sit there and enjoy your evening. Uh, look how the sun just glistens on those buildings. It's crazy. And this is the bottom part of the High Line that I was talking about and if you look close there's that little sign there where that person is with the yellow bag saying like that sign is called Little Spain so that's a brand new restaurant that they have there it supposedly is really good but I haven't tried it yet because I like to eat at home and we're gonna cross as we keep walking up on 10th Ave I'm just gonna keep showing you the view as it gets closer and closer Look at that. That is just crazy. And then as we get closer, you'll see the sign for Neiman Marcus. I uh, you know like a lot of people shop there for like name brand clothes, shoes and stuff like that. So this is what it looks like. And it's a cold morning here in New York City. They claim that it's gonna be like 46. It feels like 20, so. My hands are a bit shaky because I'm actually cold. I'm not wearing my gloves. So we're going to approach 31st Street. And I think this whole Hudson Yards in the front here where the mall is. is about two blocks going down 10th Ave. And this is another brand new building on the right side. Or the opposite side of Neiman Marcus. And this is what the rooftop looks like. This is like a picture of what they had outside, so I'm just showing you. And this is another new building as we're approaching like 32nd Street, I believe. This is a Whole Foods that's coming in 2020, we'll see. Hooray for whoever lives here. Uh, I do like Whole Foods, so that'll be good. And as we're walking by, look, there's another building going up. And right where my finger is pointing, that's another entrance to, like, go into the mall. And I think this mall is, like, I think seven or eight floors. I can't remember. When it just opened, I did go. And I think up there, you could go up there and walk on that little triangle thing. I will have to take you guys like into the mall and show you around and I'm not sure if we could go up on that part yet that triangle art part yet so we'll see um, I think it is open to the public so I'll probably try to take you guys up there at some point and that's the entrance so I went ahead and I walked up to 43rd Street because I'm actually going to the gym so there's another view of Hudson Yards. You could see those monstrous buildings like from a okay, distance. So now I'm walking back and we're back on 32nd Street and 10th Avenue. And this is just an entrance I wanted to show you. It's called the Shops, which I was kind of pointing out earlier in the video. And uh, you could see some of the restaurants, I believe, on the sign that we're going to come up to right here. Yeah, they basically are 
advertising some of our restaurants like Chitarellas and Little Spain. So we're gonna walk now. I'm hungry. This is the last view you're gonna get and I think the next time I'm gonna take you guys to the back of it where you can see the actual vessel and like some parts of by the pier and the water and stuff so if you like this content please be sure to subscribe and let me know if you have any questions and if you might want to see a different part of Manhattan. Alright guys have a good one.